Hey guys, OJ's Good 13 here, back at you with another video. I am almost done with my fed. I'm getting really excited about it. I hope you guys are too. It's um I got two more matches. I just finished uh the probably the longest match. So yeah, that's um that's good. I got the Intercontinental Championship match, which obviously is the Joker versus somebody. I'm not I'm still not even sure who, and that's the next match, so Please help me. <laughs> I'm not quite sure yet. Um, I also have the DHW Championship match of Balor versus Taker. So those are my two last matches and then it should be up. This is also a video showing you a couple things. Just a couple. Um, first one I'll go ahead and show you. Um, I got a Mason Ryan head to finally make an actual like, you know, you, this is the actual head that is used by Harrison. You know, the Arsena 0224s, as it used to be called. Um, so, I used to be using an Elite 30 uh, Blue Tista head. It was horrible. I hated it with a passion. So, yeah. Um, finally got the actual head. He is in the Fed. A um, uh, quick thing about um, the Fed is I'm not going to have tag teams for a while tag team matches because I don't have enough. All I have it would be Brooks and JTM, the Usos, and you know, maybe some random ones that I threw together, but I don't want to make random tag teams, you know what I'm saying? I want an actual tag team, so hopefully I can get a few figures that I want, like Scott Hall, to go with this guy, which is my second thing I want to show you. My uh, Wolfpack Kevin Nash. I am going to have to get the uh, battle pack because, like Wad Vig said, I don't like this head very much. Um, I, I don't like the ponytail. I don't like the face in general. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to have to get the battle pack and get the other head with the long hair and everything. Or even an Elite 16 head, whichever one. I really don't care. But um, it's a pretty alright figure. Just a, you know same body as elite 16 but repainted mine's got a lot wrong with it obviously as you can see it comes up even better on camera but i realize it now is that his body piece is different color than his arms and his head there are different colors and then i also have a paint splotch right there that i tried to get off and it won't come off so yeah minor issues i'm not too worried about it as you can see right there the black paint's actually showing through so yeah, I'm pretty sure his whole body was a black piece at one time, and then they just repainted it. Uh, it's really upsetting, but um, yeah, it's not that big of an issue. I'm not really worried about it, but like I said, if I can get Scott Hall, that'd be even better, so then I can have another tag team. Um, he's got a decent amount of accessories, uh, three, four to be exact, but he's got the spray can, you know. For the NWO, like right there on the belt, there's a pretty nice belt. Um, I prefer the the dull style. That's all my CM Punk right here. I prefer the dull to the gold gold because this one is more what it looks like, especially in WCW. It was you know for when I was little watching WCW, I thought that it was silver, not gold. So for a while there because it was just so dull it wasn't gold gold like that so fun fact about OJ there you go that's Nash and um I guess I'll go ahead and show you the Joker I also gave Joker a new attire so yeah I don't know if you can tell but before his paint was like nice and neat I made it messy it is supposed to be blotchy. It's just to make it look, you know, like Heath Ledger, where it's all messy and everything. Um, he's got the designs on his tights there. J there. J there. He's got his old kick pads. So, yeah. He's a little taller now, so that's that's better. He was pretty short before, and I, I did want him to be a taller guy. Um, in my other fed before I lost all of it, um, I didn't get to utilize a lot of his moves that he actually that I gave him because it was um, a ladder match basically you know the ultimate X style 
But in this fed, I'll actually be able to get um, a lot of stuff in. Now, when I play with my figures, uh, Joker is known as the master of the back suplex. Because he does a lot of back suplexes and German suplexes. So, And I also just literally saw the new GameStop exclusive Brock Lesnar figure comes with a Suplex City t-shirt. That's going right on the Joker. Because Joker is truly the Suplex City master. So yeah, that's that. If you guys have any suggestions on who you think should face the Joker, um, let me know. Uh, just a clarification. Before, uh, the people that have already fought in matches, basically, here, I'll just give you a few that, you know, that you could pick from. How, I mean, Nash is available. Uh, Ambrose, Rollins, JTM, uh, that's all I can think of at the top of my head. So yeah, those are just a few, you know, but I, I would like your opinion on who you think should face the Joker. So yeah, like I said, I'm almost done, two more matches, hang in there guys, I appreciate you, uh, the patience and everyone uh, asking about it. So... It is. I'm officially calling it the comeback. It's DHW the comeback because my Fed's making a comeback out of the piece of shit that it was before. They were just so horrible. Um, I went back and I watched the two that I've made, and they were just oh Jesus Christ. Actually, there was like three of them that I've made. One was like a show, and it was only five minutes long, but it still managed to have like six matches in it. And then the one where it was a hardcore ladder match, and then triple threat ladder match and then all this stuff they were they were pretty bad so i want you to know that all that happened in those don't count as a matter of fact i'm probably going to delete them but um actually no i'll keep them on so you can see how better it is now uh but yeah like you know the champions that were in there don't count anymore well except for my last last one suspension they count like um undertaker's still champion and yeah, but the United States champion was obviously Chris Benoit, but I don't have my Chris Benoit anymore, so I just gave it to um, Daniel Bryan. He also defended it in my upcoming Fed. So yeah, that's about it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. If you do want to trade, if you have anything uh, that you saw in my videos that you want, uh, let me know. Maybe we can work out a deal. Um, just kick me or DM me on Instagram. Um, that's another thing. Follow me on Instagram. I'm getting up there in the, in the uh, followers, so maybe doing a giveaway soon. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you in the next video. Later.